I'm just having to accept myself. We entered the bedroom and I sat down next to Tokiba-san. Hmm. I had so many questions that I wanted to ask. The meaning of the kiss at the Inari shrine and the reason why he didn't take something he wanted when he could easily have it. So, what happened? As I stared at his profile that was illuminated by the dim light, our glances met. Tokiba-san, why... Didn't you immediately accept Ihura-san's offer? The dream that he told me about with such bright eyes was right before his eyes. I don't know why. I know that it's a good opportunity. I actually wanted to see Tokiva-san in the courtesan's procession. When I mumbled that, Tokiva-san brought a vaguely sour smile across his face and looked away. Tokiva-san, do you not actually hate Takao-san that much? I do hate him. He's a gentleman just like me, but he act, but he acts so arrogant. But it pisses me off that he act, he's actually not around since I lose my rival. If we have to fight when I want to beat him fair and square, then I want to beat him fair and square. Is that really the reason that you refused the courtesan's procession? I didn't understand, but why wouldn't he look at my eyes when he talked to me? There's another reason, isn't there? Hmm. I wanted to know the truth. I just wanted to share the feelings that were deep within his heart. Was it bad to hope for that? I looked at Tokiva-san's eyes and... Please tell me. Can't you tell me that? Please tell me anything. Hmm, what do we take? <laughs> I'll take the... Like, wait to... Like, uh, please tell me. Please tell me? Can't you tell mm. me that? I feel like the third one is too much. You know? Mm. Can you tell me that is, like, a little bit too aggressive? Mm. I would also pick please tell me. Tokiva-san, please tell me. I don't want to. I don't want to show something uncool about myself to you anymore. I don't care at all about appearances. I just wanted to know Tokiva-san. <laughs> Tokiva-san stared at me with his green eyes. Hey, Misao. Do you like me? Huh? What did you just say? What did... What did you say just now? In response to his unexpected reply, I knitted my brow and questioned him back. I'm asking if you like me. I already expressed my feelings to you that night at Edinari Shrine. <laughs> Look at him. <laughs> Tokiwa-san gently touched my lips as if he were to confirm uh, their existence. Was that the meaning of that kiss? I didn't expect that it had such a meaning. That night, a mysterious feeling filled my heart. And now, that small flame started burning my heart again. Little by little. No, don't answer my question, okay? Uh, my question now, okay? I want you to answer after you listened to my story. I think we actually chose the uh, uh, right thing, hmm. by the way. Then Tokiwa-san pulled out a hand mirror, its size as big as his palm, out of his chest pocket. What is this? It didn't have gorgeous decorations, but with a glance I could tell this old mirror was imported. From the traces of its repairs, I could also tell that it was previously taken care of. It's a keepsake from my parents, but I don't even remember their faces clearly. Musao, so, I will tell you everything about myself. You're always telling me that my eyes and hair are beautiful. So this is difficult to talk about. Do you remember me telling you that mixed people will look down upon on the mainland? Yes. Tokiva-san looked at the small mirror. His eyes were filled with a mysterious light that was like a mix of nostalgia and pain. This mirror was my mother's. She fell in love with a foreigner and I was born on the mainland. After she became pregnant, she was dumped. I don't even re know my father's name. I bet that her mother always when she looked at him, you know, like thought about this guy that made her pregnant and then just left, you know what I mean? Because he looked like the foreigner. You know what I mean? I think so. Yeah. I doubt it. Not even what he looked like? 
No, I don't know anything about him. After my mother had me, the people around her looked harshly upon those of mixed blood. It was tough, and after moving all around the mainland, she sold me to the shop on this island. Tokiwa san. I couldn't bear to quietly hear his story, so I grabbed Tokiwa san's hand that was next to me. What? Don't take pity on me. But I didn't expect that you were sold by your own mother. It's okay. I'm happy to be on this island. Really? Yeah. These detestable, detestable eyes and hair that people threw stones at are praised as beautiful and given affection by the women on this island. Misao, do you understand? Tokiwa-san looked at the mare in his hand and made a sour face. Everyone praises me about the parts that I hate the most and curse. Do you understand what that feels like? Tokiwa-san? And when I look at my mother's only keepsake and try to remember her barely memorable face, looking this mirror, all I see reflecting back are the green eyes and blonde hair I hate so. Tokiwa-san strongly gripped the mirror. I, I don't understand so much. But if I want to rise in the red light district, I need to use these eyes and hair of mine. If I didn't look like this, I wouldn't get the offer to be in the courtesan's procession. After all, my value is this strange appearance. On the inside, I'm just some unrefined guy. So, you must think so in your mind, right? No, I... Even including those parts, I think you're great. Really? You accept everything about me? That's why I did something unlike myself and kissed you for real. Misao. Tokiwa-san then softly hugged me without a sound. Oh, look at this! Tokiwa-san. I feel healed when I'm with you. You don't believe him, right? Or no. you do? No. What? How can you not? He's so nice. His voice that rang in my ears were so gentle and relieved. Only you believe me and accept everything about me. Misao. After listening to my story, do you still want to see me in the Coden Sun's procession? Yes. Alright. If you say so, then I can't refuse the offer. Tokiwa-san, his gentle embrace became deeper and covered my body. I... I like you, Misao. Up until now, I've sold love to many women, but I can't do that to you. I can only give you my true love. Tokiwa-san released me from his deep embrace and passionately stared at my face. I'll ask you again. Do you like me? The lights in his clear jade eyes were wavering. I... I... Tokiwa-san... Hmm, <laughs> where... <laughs> what are you gonna do? Tell me. I would say you love me. What? No. Oh my. <laughs> <That's not>. What? <sighs> I I would just hug him. No, Cookie, you're gonna destroy our bond. Like we can't. You hug really want to just say you love him? Like I don't understand the difference between not firmly and say you love him. Oh, Greta. <laughs> what? Mm. You say I'm young. Alright, you say you love him. Go ahead. Or not firmly. Tell me. No, say you love him. That, that's what you want to do. I'm not sure if that's the right decision, though. Can I look it up? No, you can't. <laughs> not firmly. Say you love him. Okay. I like you. So, Tokiwa son tightly hugged my body again. I'm happy. If you say so, then I can make up my mind. I'll use my eyes, hair, and everything else to reach for the top. Did we just like told him to be a like a prostitute? Yeah, uh, like the top prostitute, basically. <laughs> like the pros, the top prostitute. Mhm. Mm Suddenly, his voice became lively, and something hot started to shine in his eyes. But it doesn't matter. It doesn't mean that I won't want to win over someone or get back at anyone. Because 
You said you like me. I'll aim for the top to accept myself. Ah, oh, that's nice. His hug became deeper and more passionate. Tokyo-san's long finger then touched my cheek that was probably blushing red. Yes, huh? And our lips gently touched each other's lips. To Tokyo-san, and our second kiss became deeper and sweeter. I felt my mouth being sucked strongly and deeply. <laughs> I didn't expect that he had such intense passions hidden deep in the gentle color of his tongue cookie. <laughs> Tonight, for the first time... Oh no, I think shit is going to get... You know, intense here. For the first time, my heart was burned with the fire of love hiding within Tokiwa san. To Tokiwa san, I had difficulty breathing, so I scratched his big exposed chest. <laughs> Miss Sao, I'm sorry. <laughs> Were you in pain? <laughs> Tokiwa san finally released my lips and his eyes wavered with worry. No, I'm okay. Then I want to do a little more. He slowly laid my body down on the bed. <laughs> Tokiwa-san, what are you doing? I won't do anything scary. Tokiwa-san put his head of curly golden locks on my chest as I lay down. My heartbeat continued to increase in my chest. So, can we stay like this just for a little bit? His low voice reverberate, rever reverberated directly to the bones of my chest. I felt sweet, soft, and comfortable. Yes. When I'm with you like this, it makes my feelings warm up. I feel the same way. To think that I would aim for the top with these feelings. I couldn't even imagine it before. And so we slowly passed the night like this. Tweet, 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 tweet. Tweet, tweet. I thought I heard the singing of birds from outside. I felt the refreshing light of morning in my field of vision. When I quite, qu quietly refreshing opened... lights in the morning. I'm just like, oh, don't put light on my face, please. <laughs> yeah, true. Just like no morning. I'm not waking up in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> when I quietly opened my eyes, morning, how can so. you? How can you, like she said, how, um, I quietly open my eyes. How can you, like, loud open your eyes? You know, like, that doesn't make a sound, does it? Okay. Oh, no, 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 it's like... No, yeah, it's stupid. Huh? Tokiwa-san was in front of me, happily watching me sleep. <laughs> Tokiwa-san, is it morning already? You should have woken up, me up. It's about 5.30 a.m. You were sleeping so comfortably that I c just couldn't wake you up. Turkey doesn't smile at me with a refreshing look on his face. Well, I'll go with you to the entrance. Thanks to you, Miss Sao, I made, my, uh, made up my mind. I have something that I have to tell iroha -san. Let's see... <laughs> what?! <laughs> no! There's no fucking way! There's no fucking way! Why would you say you love him? <laughs> There's no way, like, I don't want to play this anymore. <laughs> you say it's my fault? <laughs> like, you went way too deep in, like, 100%. No! Can, <laughs> can we do this again? No! No, we have to keep going. No, I don't want yeah. to. I don't What's want up? to. We <laughs> fucked up. No, I didn't fuck up. What? You said I should do it. Yeah, because that was, like... When I said something and you were like, no, I think we should like say this, are you sure? I was like, okay, go ahead and see what happens. No, Cookie. No, this is unfair. <laughs> like, the reason I thought hugging him was the best was because he kissed you to show his feelings, you know? So why not do the same to him? <laughs> Baby,